Okay, I'm running a little bit behind, but so I don't know if anybody else has been to, um, this is, I'm at Wesley Hospital, but parking is so horrible, right? Parking is so freaking horrible. I had to park on the other end. They have a parking lot, right? Parking structure. It gets packed. Like if you come here before 9.30, let's be honest. If you come here before 9.15, you're not getting a parking spot. All the old people, I know they're not walking all the way across the hospital. This muff is huge. I know you're not walking all the way across it. So if they had to park at the parking lot that, or the parking structure that I do, they're not going. They're not seeing whoever it is they have to see. Like the emergency is all the way on the other side. It took me less than three minutes to get across it. I say maybe four. You know what I'm saying? I'm re I was recording most of the time that I was walking. I think I started recording right when I got off the elevator. But yeah, it took me about three minutes. Ain't no way. And now I got to make it to my daughter's school by 11.50. And that's what I be talking about. Like, <laughs> it don't be enough time in the day, it seems like. And I don't say, I be trying to stay out the way. I just be working. I just be working. I don't even do too much. But then when I get her, go home, try to relax a little bit. Then I have dogs to walk, content to create. Thank you. Supposed to be starting a new job pretty soon, but I gotta wait for, uh, I gotta wait to do another physical. They want me to do a physical for the job so they can make sure I can actually do the job. No big deal, but they weren't gonna be able to get me in until next Thursday at one location. And then this upcoming Friday at a different location. So you know I have to take the sooner date. You know I have to take the sooner date because I'm not trying to wait another two weeks to start work. Cause then that means my first check ain't gonna get here till close to the end of the month. That's too much for me. <laughs> yeah, so I was talking to the nurse one of the nurses why I got a zoom to this school. One of the nurses was telling me that in in her hall alone, there's four sets of twins. It's like, is this the year of like twins? Like somebody let me know. This gotta be the year of like twins and like did y'all hear about like did y'all hear about that one family? Like before I play the video, did y'all hear about that one family that that had twins on the 18th, and it was the same day as their birthday, August. It was August 18th. They had a set of twins. Mom and, if I'm not mistaken, mom and dad birthday was August 18th, and then they had twins on August 18th. Like, that made my head hurt. Cause if you know, you know. Wow. <laughs> that sent people for a loop. That's a real brain freeze right there. Can you imagine, like? On a funny note, ain't nothing serious. No, not, and on a funny note, like your birthday don't mean nothing now. Like <laughs> as an adult, you know, <laughs> like damn, we all got the same birthday. Like you about to be broke. <laughs> you gotta you divvying up money in ways you never thought you would have. It's just ridiculous. Okay, I really don't like the fact that this city is so damn big. But you know, we're not gonna complain about that. You know, we just gotta manage our time better. <laughs> but yeah, I'm on my own. I'm kind of late picking up my baby. She ain't gonna be too mad at me though, but the teachers already know what's going on. You know what I'm saying I just been running around, so it's been taking me a while to kind of get my get myself in order. But that does not give my daughter the right to not listen. So we'll be having a couple talks about about how she's been feeling and what's going on with her. But that's crazy. What is this? A bank? It's gotta be a bank or business. That's it's for auction, but it was like a weird location. It looked kind of funny, but you know, God is good. Uh, so I can't be too mad, but this is just a recording so y'all can see how long it actually takes me to get to my child. We just left the hospital, but you know what I'm saying? So I know for a fact that it takes, it's, it's probably, it's probably like a 10 minute difference between where I'm at, you know what I mean? Where I gotta, where I gotta get to at the distance but the sad part is like the school to home is literally three minutes away so it's like i try to leave the house with enough time for us to chill and relax but i still i'm still working on that so to me it's like i might as well not even go home 
after I after I dropped the middle schooler off. Like there's only like a 50 minute difference between when I gotta drop one off and drop the other one off. So, ooh, that's for sale. I wonder how much that house was. So to me, it, it get it, it, you know it can get it can get annoying because I'm going home to turn around and leave right back again. Like, what's the point? So, like, you know, I got to get myself together, maybe bring some stuff, maybe walk the dogs a little bit longer before I head out so then I can uh, comfortably get her to school on time. It really shouldn't be that hard, but uh, you already know how it goes. You know what I'm saying? Just do the best you can. You know, don't be too hard on yourself. Just realize, you know, that you're on your own wave and don't get upset about the small stuff. You know what I mean? We, we all got to make it. We all got to survive. We all got to do it with a smile on our face or not. You know what I mean, you don't you don't have to. You know what I mean? You can look mad about everything. But who wants to live like that? I'm pretty sure no one does. I'm like three minutes from her school. But as you can see, I'm moving. And then I run into a red light. Wonderful. And I'm trying to have patience. I'm trying to have patience. God is good. God is good. So I've been looking at new cars. Which on the topic real quick. Been looking at new cars, right? I, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I like the, uh, is it the Audi? The Audi looking nice. The Infinity looking nice. One second. Okay, I made it. Picked up baby girl. And missed a train, bruh. I missed the train. I missed the train. I'm so glad I missed the train. Yeah, come on. My goodness. That's probably the worst thing about this city is like the fact that it's a train directly in the middle of it. It ain't like, it ain't like uh, in Long Beach. You know what I mean? Like the train is on PCH. Like ain't nobody worry about that. It, you know, come when it come. I don't even, I don't even touch that part of the city often. So that didn't even matter. But this, it's a train. It's a train by my crib going that way. And I can get stuck getting to work unless I like, go up to like 14th street or something and then it's another train right here like it's a train literally right there trying to get to my daughter's school it's a train trying to get trying to trying to get to the other side of town too so if you're not if you're not too careful you'll be stuck between three or four trains what do you want bro 